So in order to make wine, you obviously need grapes. Now, you can get your grapes from all over the world, all over whatever country you're from. You can get it shipped in with juice. I prefer to go harvest the grapes myself. One of the reasons why I do this is because great wine is really made in the vineyard. I get my wines from the Shenandoah Valley Aviation within Virginia, which is a very unique microclimate. It is right in the middle of two mountain ranges, the Blue Ridge Mountain Range and the Appalachian. This gives it its own little climate, microclimate within Virginia. The grapes they grow include French American hybrids, a lot of vinifera, Cabernet Franc, Petit Verdot, Fauvignier. You can honestly just go for hours. So we're gonna harvest Petit Verdot today to make a wine and I'm gonna show you a little bit of that process. Let's go to the vineyard. <laughs> Welcome to the vineyard. All right, so we finally made it. We're at m &R Vineyards, which grows quality fruit. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go through the grapes and kind of find clusters that I like. Beautiful ones, large ones. And then I'm gonna take them, I'm gonna drop them right into this lug. And from here, I'm gonna put them in my bins and then take them home, crush them, distem them, make some wine. All harvested. It's about a ratio of 75% Cabernet Franc and then 25% Petit Verdot. I like that combination for Virginia, that blend, because those are my two favorite grapes from the area. And together, it's gonna make a beautiful color, a nice body, well rounded, along with a nice mouthfeel. So I'm gonna take these grapes back, crush, distem, and get the fermentation going. Oh. 